Hey guys, Brito here. Welcome back to House Slipper. Here we are for part God knows what. I don't know what part we're up to, but um, we're a long way through our Let's Play series. Back here at um, Heisenberg's home. Um, my idea for this episode is um, I have a cousin named Jade, around about the same age as me. She probably actually is the same age as me, either a year older than me or the same age. Um, she's currently um, having a very, very long term battle with cancer. Um, and yeah, I won't go into too much detail, but it's not looking good, so... Um, my idea of this episode is just to try and make a house for her. Something that I think that she would enjoy, something that I think would be perfect for her. So I chose this house, one, because it's got a pool out in the back, and I know she absolutely loves swimming. Um, so let's pull out the back for her, and obviously all this big area outside to, to do her um, entertaining. And that sort of thing. So, is that dirty? Looks dirty, but it's not. So, if we come inside, I've cleaned everything up, knocked down a few walls and that sort of stuff. So, I'd like to come into like the main lounge room, the formal big dining room here, massive kitchen. Um, in here, maybe an office. In here, I've knocked down. Well, I'd actually knock down the wall, put it back up again, knock down this wall. I want to turn this into like a big bathroom slash ensuite where obviously her bedroom, her and her partner's bedroom will be in here. Ensuite in here and also access for visitors to come through into the bathroom as well and a huge garage. Um, the one thing I was thinking of is knocking this down and turning this into like a... Um, Um, like a closet for her to put all her clothes and that sort of stuff in. So, if we go from this wall here, three and four, knock down these four. There we go, they should all be gone. And then, I'm going to need to put in some walls here. Oh, new building skill available. Right, so there we go. So, this will all be changed of course get rid of that so be a double bed in here um, it's kind of a little bit restricting but we should be able to get it to work so in here will be as I said like um, a little little storage area like a walk-in wardrobe so I'm gonna put carpet in for here um, Let's go, let's go carpet in the bedroom as well. That, we don't have to worry about covering that. No, we don't really need to be about covering that either. And then that'll be obviously the bathroom. We need to change the walls for sure in here. So I'm not sure of her favorite colors and that sort of stuff. So I guess we'll just try and make things um, as bright as we can and just put in random colors, I guess, and just hope that um, it would be a color that she would actually enjoy. So we'll go pink and like a beigey sort of color on these walls. So it's going to be like a pretty, pretty luxurious house, I hope. Something that um, she would be stoked to live in. I do also believe that um, she has House Flipper as well, which she has played in the past, and she does uh, watch, I don't know if she watches all my YouTube videos, but I do know that she used to watch um, a fair few of them, so hopefully she will see this one. Alright, let's get this painted. Perfect. Uh, not really sure on that colour, but... It's fine. Let's go. Curtains and blinds. We want closed blind in there. So we'll get our curtains. We'll go narrow curtain. Uh, we'll just go with the white one, I think. Assemble that. Try and put plenty of storage on the other side. There we go. So you'd want to come in and have cupboards down this side. It's just a matter of having a look and seeing uh, what sort of cupboards the 
that we have available. I mean, I really do like this one. Oh, it's a pretty big cupboard, but huge storage space. Um, I don't want that, that's for sure. I think... Should we go? Is there enough room? There probably is enough room for a dressing table. Like up this back corner there. Thinking like a shoe cabinet, if I can find it. Somewhere. There it is. We can go white with steel handles. Perfect. That there. Um, I was thinking of a mirror in here somewhere, but I don't know if I have enough room now. Let's go with a chair. Um, I think this one. Don't mind this one. I'll go with a white chair as well. There we go. So we've got a lot of storage space in here, which I think, now me looking at it, I really need to move this as far over as we can. Probably say maybe there. That way at least it looks like back, back, back. Where are we going? Oh, it's hitting the curtain I think. So we can get those doors open. There we go. Let's go with a little plant on top, little fern. So there's not really much else we can put in here. Um, Let's go with a little, it's a little trash bin there. It's kind of in the way there, though, isn't it? I guess we could probably put put one there. It's not a great deal else that we can put in here. Um, we'll go with a, a little bunny as well. Up on top there. Let's see if we can find. I might have to put some vases and stuff in along here just to make it look like um, obviously products and stuff. There you go. Uh, white one. What else do we have? Nothing else really that size. Of candles, I think, would be perfect in there as well. There you go, so that's not bad. We're gonna have to put in like a ceiling lamp uh, about there. We'll do, I don't think maybe we do we have a switch there. I'm not sure if we really need something there, I don't think so. Um, as far as paintings go. Nice bright, which way is it meant to be? This way, isn't it? Nice bright painting up on the wall. There we go. So that's like the little, little um, closet, walk in robe, wardrobe, whatever you want to call it. But we'll work it on out here. Don't want the beta rewards. Sort by price descending. I want something, definitely something elegant. Which I think double bed heart is probably the way to go. I might go with dark furniture. Uh, I might go with a light yellow. Beach. Let's go. I think beach. No, there's probably not, not going to be a massive deal of room either side of the bed, but there should still be enough. Um, let's go all. Type in bedside. Um, go with these ones. I don't think I've used these ones before, actually. There you go. Let's go with lamps. Of course, my favourite lamps. I absolutely love these lamps. They go well with everything. Um, I think that one it's not back far enough. There we go. I don't know if we'll even get curtains in there. 
now that we've um, put a bed and stuff in. We can put in um, blind though. There we go. Can we put in wide, short? Why won't it let us put it there? It won't because it's not a window because it's a door. Well, that sucks. And I don't think if we go wide, short. All right, let's go narrow, short then. That's what I was meant to do in the first place. Um, have we got like a light yellow? Gold flowers, which we don't really want. Um, brown, let's go with the brown. go which kind of yeah it goes in front of the bed there doesn't it? let's see if we can move this out no move it out one more yeah it's kind of out away from the wall which sucks a little bit Let's move this to the front of that table. Let's move this table forward uh, two. There we go. Front of the table. This table forward couple. It's a little bit better. At least it's not, you know, clipping through the bed, which is the main thing. Um, in here, I was going to put in some cupboards as well. I think this might be too wide for here. It is just. Then I think we'll go with these ones. There we go. Um, I was thinking of a TV too. I don't know if we'll get TV up there. I might put a TV on here. Maybe just a. Um... Oh, geez, that is a big TV still. Even this, it's probably not that big, but we'll make it work, I think. Put in a loudspeaker there as well. Now, can we fit DVD player? No, it definitely doesn't want to go there. That's fine, doesn't matter. Um, let's go all, let's put in a mirror. Mirror in here. Let's maybe go down a little bit. There you go. So that's pretty basic, but it's still pretty elegant, I think. Um, I wouldn't know what to put up on the wall up here. I mean, I always, I've always liked that picture. That picture's pretty cool. I like that one. Right, so now we need to organize what sort of paints we like definitely wanted to go with like a brown on this wall um, light cream again maybe see how that looks it doesn't look it's not too dark which is good uh, can we get in behind there somehow. There we go. It's always a pain when you can't get right where you want to go. A little bit more paint on the brush. The roller even would be good. Is that all the wall? We didn't miss anything, I don't think. No, I think that's it. I have seen also the developers are in the process of what looks like, if I've guessed correctly, they're in the process of organising some new plants for us. Whether that's inside or outside, I don't know. Um, I'm hoping it's um, a gardening aspect. I hope at some stage they're going to allow us to put furniture outside as well. That'll be awesome. 
Alright, so there we go. I think this room is pretty much done. So we've got the bed there. We'll go ceiling lamps. I really don't know what to go with in here. Let's go with a cube. We'll go with steel. Let's go one there. One there. And maybe another one back there. There we go. Flick the light on. Oop, wrong button. Installations. Very bright in here. Very, very bright. But that's fine. So that's done. So now we've got the bathroom. So I'm going to have the door here. So let's organise our doors. Um, I think we'll just go internal white doors. Let's have a look. Make sure we've got door on the right way. I can never see that way it is. So it locks from the inside. That one is back the front. There we go. So I was going to put a toilet here. Uh, so the installations, toilet plumbing system. Uh, maybe about there. Let's go bathroom. Go with a, just a standard toilet. There we go. And now I want to see if we can actually. Can we, we can cover that. Thank God for that. I want to make sure we can cover that little spot. Have we got a grey? We do. How big is it? Massive. Um. That one, beige, cream, let's go cream. Where's that going to go? I think that's probably too much, but we only need like a little square, which I don't know. Pink square. Oh, I didn't want to do that. There we go. Move that. Perfect. That just sort of covers it. Um, so, I think... We got installations. It's our sink system. There. Let's go bathroom. Put in a modern sink. I'm not going to say it. Because when I say it, I usually always make a mistake. Ooh, like that. End up with water everywhere. We didn't that time. Thank God. Okay, let's put in um, toilet paper. So you walk in, you've got this little area here. I don't know whether we should go... Um, like this... So it's still a bathroom, but it's kind of got that wall there. Come in, maybe put in... Put a shower in here. Then we can get a bathtub like over here somewhere. So let's put the shower in this corner. I don't know if it's going to hang out too far though. Maybe... Bathtub. Bathtub will be better, I'd say. See if we can get a bathtub in here. Uh, we'll go with a curved one. There we go, put that down. We press the wrong one then. Oh, damn it, we did. Doesn't take much, does it? There we go. Switch to clean. 
could have gone over one, maybe. I really don't know. Let's go installation. Uh, towel rack. In there. Where are we? No, it's in installations, isn't it? Need to try and put in a shower somewhere if we can. We really need a um it's gonna be a tight fit, isn't it? Installations, let's go. Shower system. Why don't I just do it there? I reckon if we put this up, it's not going to have enough room. Um, store, bathroom, shower. No, I didn't think it would. Okay, knock that out. Let's put in a wall there. Um, I think if we go there... There, I hope. So we're not going to be the most ideal bathroom. Perfect. Alright, now can we go... Knock that wall out. Now let me assemble this and see how silly it looks. We might have to move that door. I'll probably... Damn it! Probably should put my phone on um, silent too, but there we go. It's always the longest part, isn't it, doing the bathroom? Because I haven't put all these things together. Still like one of the um, one of our upgrades to be that it just auto installs. It'll be so much easier. And this covers that door really badly. Okay, but we can walk in and around. So let's sell you. Um, get the hammer out. It's a multifunctional room. Lock you and you down. Oh, let's go back and hit that wall then. We don't want to hit that one. We want to go with a full wall here, once all this stuff's ready to disappear. And a half wall. I'm going to have to paint those again. Which was light cream, wasn't it? There we go. Come back in. That's plenty of room. If we go back to our doors. And our white door. Um, this way. I don't know how that got over there, but okay. So we come into the bathroom. We have water all over the floor. So we come straight into the bathroom. I'd like to put in um, a little mat here. What colour? Let's go red. Maybe like there somewhere. And then we come in through here where we've got the sink and all that sort of stuff. So let's go into a mirror, just a plain white mirror. Go in here. I want to go with laundry basket. I wonder if we can get you there. I don't know if we'll get another one next to it. No, we can't. Damn, okay. There we go. So we'll walk in. We've got our shower, our bath. Um, I want to go shelf. Let's go white. And maybe another one like here. Double shelf to put stuff on. There's nothing on this wall, so we really need. Decent sized picture, so let's go to our gallery, which may take a little while to load. Uh, 
Hopefully it doesn't crash on us. Because I haven't opened it yet, it's going to take a fair while, I think, for it to load. Oh, there we go. We should have some decent photos down here. Um, this one I was thinking. It's got like one and a half meters. It's probably too big, I'd say. 1.2 might still be too big. No, that's alright. Oh, let's go there. So let's move it across a little bit. Same level, but we'll move it across to there. Better. Right, so that'll sort of change that wall a little bit. Um, something like this. I know we've used before, but we'll put this there. Now we need to work out what we're going to do with um, this floor, these tiles. So floor, tiles. I usually just go with white. I mean, white's always a pretty good just go-to tile. There we go. It's just a matter of doing the walls and stuff. Now I think we can paint in here and then tile in here. So let's have a look at wall tiles. Um, maybe go with any of these ones. I don't know. Now if we go into paint probably use that light cream again. Then also, maybe even like a bloody red. So when we walk in, we've kind of got feature feature wall to there, and then cream walls from here around. And then obviously tile the rest. open this so we can access that a bit better. I do like these tiles. 3D style. Oops, pick one up. That'll help. Oh, shut that door as well. It's a shame that we can't tile like three or four walls in a go. Same as like painting as our upgrade. Right, let's go back to our wall tiles. Another stack there. I'm probably going to need another stack over here. Have to put some candles and stuff up there on those shelves. One thing I've just thought of, I wonder if we can put stuff um, not really on that sink that we've got it there, but maybe underneath the sink. Is there another one? There is. And another one. Perfect. Didn't miss any. No, good. So walk in, come over to here and go others. Drag this all the way down. Put a few of these guys up here again. Like that. Uh, we'll go white and black. Then the black and white, which is made that move funny.
Sorry guys, I had to cough and rather not do it in the camera. In the camera. In the microphone. Thank god there's no camera, I'll probably scare the majority of you people away. Beautiful, so that'll fill that out a little bit. Let's go into here. I doubt we'll be able to. No. I'll put anything on the sink either, which is a shame. Alright, let's go with some sconces. We want to put... Uh, dark lampshade white up above here of course I see in here we want something a little bit different I'm thinking like this big reflector lamp uh, we need to put another switch in here shut this door there we go so we've got like a little bathroom um, area in here, which is pretty cool, and we've got all our toilet and sink, and we get our bath and shower, so plenty of room, come out through here, bathroom, a uh, bedroom, and walk-in robe, put a door on, which can go this way, so it locks from the inside, we need a door in here, which go this way as well. Is that the right way? It is. That locks from the inside. We'll go a door here as well, which locks from the inside. Beautiful. So as I said, bedroom, walk in, We've got our bathroom, which we'll turn the light off because we'll probably slow the game down a fair bit. We've got our um, garage out here. So we put in our installation. We'll go with washer hopefully that's enough room uh, installation no home appliances mount washer I knew it wouldn't let us do it knew we had to be over one more so frustrating I don't know why it lets you put it there if you can't put it there if you know what I mean Washer there, let's go. Uh, water heater. Don't know what the difference is, we'll just put it over this wall, I think. Alright, let's assemble this. Take that one out first. I really hate doing this. I used to love it when the game first came out, and now it's just um, kind of annoying having to install so much stuff. But uh, this one, this one, oh. ah, water everywhere again. Typical. There we go. Now let's go into other. We'll go basket. Laundry basket. I'm going to put down three different colours. Obviously, you've got whites and you've got colours and you've got darks and all that sort of stuff. So, um, we'll go with some shelving. We'll go with white out here as well. So unfortunately, there's nothing that kind of looks like laundry powder. So, Let's go with this like a small green box, which is say our laundry powders in there, and then uh, what was I thinking? I don't know, something like this as like our fabric softener and all that sort of stuff. There we go. Nothing too fancy. Uh, we've got to look at color for the hallway. This is going to be the office, so let's go in here and um, get this started. So let's go into t no, desks we want to go to. I think I want to go with a corner desk. Um, still doesn't work properly. Let's go dark wood. That's fine. There we go. We'll go with a chair. 
not with a swivel chair. Want to be comfortable. Okay, home appliances, no, electronics I should say. Monitor. Uh, keyboard and mouse. Let's go with um, another monitor down here. I don't know, it kind of doesn't want to fit there, does it? Let's not. Um, we'll go with a hanging TV. Not an upside down one. Up there. So they can do their business stuff and then also watch TV, whatever they need to do. Um, there's an office cabinet in here somewhere. There we go. White, grey, bench. That'll do. That looks perfect. That can go there. We'll go with a sofa. I'm thinking of this one, but in white leather. Will it fit? No, it won't fit. Damn you. That was idea that I had a single sofa in there. I don't know if this one will fit either. It's wider I think. It is. So how about we go um, chairs. We'll go with a poof. Over in this corner. Um, over here. Not really sure what to do here. Cupboard. How about um, Wood cherry, no. Older, no. I think Venge, Venge is going to be the closest colour. There we go, it's like a bit of extra storage. Um, I want to go into plants. The Diefenbachia, or whatever it's bloody called. Okay, other, let's go mirror, put one in sideways, let's go pictures and paintings, let's go with this one, A picture of say her mum, or even my auntie, um, I don't think Oh, damn it. It's not going to let us put that one there either. Um, how about a picture of a cat? There we go. This is going to be pretty basic in here. We don't need to go too over the top. Put in a little bin down there. I'm not going to put too much um, on this table. Oh, let's go grey and wicker. There you go, a little bit of storage, not too much. I oh, don't need a whiteboard or anything. I'm thinking maybe like a little grey box over here. Classic book there, maybe like a red book. There, I think that's probably about it. We don't need too much more. We've still got um, plenty of stuff to do out in the lounge room, dining room, kitchen yet. So there you go, beautiful. Let's work out what we're going to do with our blinds and curtains. Hopefully, we'll be able to get a decent curtain in here. Okay, so I want to go wide and short. Uh, brown stripes, no. Orange. Actually, you want to probably go light lily to match the puff. Why not? Let's see if we can get a similar paint colour. Actually, matches pretty well. Let's go. Not pale pink. Let's go dirty pink. 
Then we'll go with our usual light cream, which we probably should stop selling every time we finish with it, but anyway. Look at that, perfect match. Um, no one might like, she probably absolutely hates pink and purple. Lavender or whatever you want to call it, lily. So if you're watching it, Jade, I do apologise if you hate these colours. Right, let's get this, all these other sides done. The cream. Just making sure the light was on. It's good though when you turn the light on, it actually turns that TV on. Is that? That looks weird, doesn't it? Like it's not painted properly. It's just a shadow from something. Just a shadow from something. There we go, done. Alright, beautiful. So the little office. Done. Let's come out to here. Now I want to um, sort out our kitchen. I want to do like a nice area where they can sit, but that is... No, it's not too bad. Also, it looks massive, doesn't it? White with black. White and white. That's not too big. That's pretty good, actually. Should we move it back, though? Let's leave it for now. I want to put in... Uh, maybe a fridge over here. So home appliances. Where is it? Here it is. The big double fridge. And then we can work our um, the rest of our kitchen off this. So white, white, white is fine. Do that one. Do one of these ones. So we want to do a bit of everything. Let's go with another single door. I'd like to go, which is not there. Uh, appliances, electric cooker. Is that? That's right. And then kitchen. Go with another double. I don't think we'll get another one in there. No, definitely not. Alright, so what we'll do is we'll move everything to the left. this over to there um, appliances so where is it it's in kitchen isn't it there we go new steel cooker hood which is up way high and that's not even centered I don't think why won't it let me move it now okay well, go away then because we're not close enough to the wall, that's why. Ah, very smart man I am. There we go, that's in the centre. Let's go... Some shelving. Don't know why. We have to have a gap. Doesn't look that bad with a gap though, does it? Not really. Let's move it over. Let me move you over a couple. There we go. Doesn't look too bad. Let's go other. Sort out to our um, utensils. Okay, uh, where are we going to put this? 
Can't put it there. Maybe over here. That'll that'll work if it's over there. Oh, this one. Let's go wood. We'll go black. That looks pretty good. Um, we don't need anything else. In here, I don't think. I know this is like a sauna towel, but... Actually, let's put it over there, and then we can go into our knife stand. Now, look at the recipes. Cutting board, of course. And where is our knife? It's all the way down the bottom, still. Um, home electronics, I don't think... Oh, we'll get one in there, that's cool. What about our coffee maker? A little bit busy, but that works. I think that's pretty good. Sorry about bumping the microphone again. Let's go. Um, floor tiles. What are we going to do in here? I don't know about this. We're going to look pretty stupid. Doesn't look very upmarket though, does it, when you do that? It's not the worst. Let's bring that forward one. There we go. And to the left. So we kind of can't see it as much. Um, we'll go chairs. Bar chair. Well, that's probably not the best place to sit and eat. But I mean, it'll work. Four is more than enough, I think. Let's go other and put in the bin as well. We're going to need a bin. So we go. There's a the kitchen. Got to do a massive dining room now. I want to put in a big table, but um, it's about as big as it's going to be. That one, Ooh, red. Go Venge, go with a darker table. Um, we go chairs, something comfy. Put one at either end, then do the sides. I've seen this wicker bin. How big is that? It's massive, isn't it? Too big to put there. Really think it is. So let's go. Little flower pot in the middle. There we go. And I think. Um, let's go floor panels and covering. I want to go with a lighter colour because everything else, all the furniture in that's going to be dark so go from there, let's go from here that way when the furniture is dark it'll still kind of brighten the room up with this perfect Kind of a weird shape there, isn't it? I, I want to leave that there though, that brickwork and stuff. Um, I do want to put in a couple of cupboards along here, so. You there. 
maybe another one there and then look a decent um, cabinet with glass doors no what am I looking for I think I've already gone past it several times case there we go kind of in the middle there somewhere yeah that kind of works all right I've got the lounge room do these need to be clean they don't okay dinner curtains and blinds so you can go there I don't think we're going to bother putting curtains in here. We'll just use our blinds and stuff. Right now, lounge room. I don't know. I think electronics. The TV above the fireplace, I think, is always awesome. Let's go about there. Let's see if we can put in. Bench shelf, we've got enough room. Not really, so we'll move this up. A couple of levels. There we go. So we can go with our electronics. Our loudspeaker on there. Sort these bad boys out down here. We put this one, hide it away in the corner there. Then we need to put in a decent sofa. Price descending, price descending, which is what I want. An elegant leather sofa. I think we'll go with the brown. There we go from there to there that's fine and if we go with um, a leather no navy black leather no dark leather is that a similar not really it's kind of going to be hard to find one of the same so let's just do the exact same one over here as well. Come on. Okay, we'll go cupboards, bookcase uh, in here as well. Let's go home appliance, electronics, not appliances. You in there, you in there. Definitely want to have the, the sound pumping, whether it be music she's playing or gaming. I know she does love gaming, so whatever she wants to pump out, she can. That sort of thing going on. I see coffee table, go there, Got another one. Over here. Let's go to the lamps. There we go. So this wall here, I don't know whether to change that or leave it. Um maybe turn it into like a feature wall. So let's go brown what was it, coffee? Cocoa, there we go. Or cocoa, not cocoa. That will go light cream again. All the way down. This is like another feature wall there. And the rest will go around with this light cream again.
Let's fill it up with that and then use this. I'd like to redo the outside as well, but it's just going to take too long. The video will be lengthy enough as it is, I think, without um, doing all the outside as well. These two, beautiful. Still, the paint still doesn't seem to go as far as it used to. There we go. We're not painting any further than that. Down. Keeping the brickwork in. There we go. So I guess um, one thing that um, I really should say to you guys, I guess especially you guys that live in Australia, even if you live in a different country, if there's somewhere out there um, that takes donations as far as can cancer goes, like in Australia we have the Cancer Council who help out uh, with people that are suffering uh, with cancer and also it does not only helps them but helps the family as well. So. Please feel free to donate, um, I guess, in Jade's honour to the Cancer Council or, you know, if you've got your own family member who's also is or has um, had a, their own battle with cancer, whether they um, may have won or lost that battle, you know, we should all be donating to the Cancer Council to try and help, help, um, help them work out a solution for this cruel cruel disease that takes too many people and um, too many people at a very very young age like I'm only 33 I believe Jade is 33 or she may be 34 I do apologize for not knowing your exact um, age Jade as well if you're watching this but um so for someone to have cancer at such a young age is just not only devastating for you know the person themselves but also their entire family you know, she's got um, obviously my auntie and uncle, which is like her mum and dad, who are there by her side through everything, and also got two two beautiful sisters as well. So it's not only affects you know the person going through it, but it also affects the entire family, and um, also you know Jade's partner as well. She's been affected just as much as um, Jade herself. So it's um. I said it's a cruel, cruel disease, and um, if any of you guys can reach into your pocket and help by donating to whether it be the Cancer Council in Australia or whether it be, you know, as I said, like a charity in your country that helps out people with um, cancer, you know, that would be absolutely amazing. We really need to try and work at getting rid of this um, cruel disease that takes way too many people that's way too young an age it's just it's just devastating to be honest it's yeah it's not pretty i've lost um several other family members from cancer and oh, i don't want to lose any more but i think unfortunately it's just it's going to happen because it is one of those diseases that if you don't catch it catch it really early um you know it's going to be either a very long very very long fight or you know there's not gonna be much fight there but I um yeah I, I hate to see anybody go through it it's um devastating it's absolute shit and I hate it and um, especially it being a family member like that that makes it worse but to seeing anybody go through it it's just um it's absolute shit to be honest but yeah, so if you guys can donate, then 
please donate to whatever charity it is in your area, whether it be Cancel Cancer, Cancer, Cancel Australia, or the local charity to you. But um, I think we've pretty much finished once we get rid of this graffiti, of course, and probably place a few lights. So we come through the main entrance way to the lounge room, which the switch is on the wrong side. So with the lounge room here, I might go with some ceiling lamps. Might let's go with some more halogens again, I think. I'm not going to try and line things up too good. And then we come through to the dining room. It's got a lot of storage here. Obviously, a couple of bookcases as well. Come through to the massive kitchen. No, we don't want to do that. The massive kitchen, black and white sort of theme. And we come down the hallway, which is really plain. Really need something at the end here. So let's go. Um, maybe put a mirror in here and see if we can fit this guy. Yeah, perfect. That'll fit. That'll help fill it out a little bit. There we go. So down the hallway, first room on the right, we've got the office. Nice, cool little office. Plenty of plenty of place, space to relax. Plenty of space for storage, that sort of thing. A little bit gaming or working. We come through to the left, which is the ensuite slash bathroom. So the toilet and sink here. Bath and shower. Huge picture of Paris on the wall, of course. We go through to the bedroom. Huge double bed. Very, very elegant double bed. And then through to the little walk-in wardrobe. Place for, for Jade and her partner to get ready in the morning. And then come back out through here, back through to the hallway, which that hits there, which it shouldn't. And then into the garage, plenty of space for the cars and bikes and toys, whatever they want. And a space to wash. You can never not have enough spaces to wash. So, all right, let's go out the front. Um, what I'm going to do is take a picture from here. That way, you guys... We'll have a surprise if you haven't seen the thumbnail and gone in. You see the thumbnail and you'll have a surprise when you go inside. Don't want to spoil it, but um, so that's the house for Jade. Let's um, sell the house now. See what sort of money we make. Okay, Georgia Shinua. Shinua is not going to buy it. So we paid 118000 for it. Um, I've already gone up to 210, so that's a pretty good profit. A lot of the exact same 210 price range, which is weird. 214 for Veronica. Jimmy Trader, 214 as well. The Smoth family, 219. Dylan Trust, 220. The Gentarts, 221. Raphael Urko, 222. Profit of 104,000. So let's try and get another. Five and a half out of him. Or six, that'll do. Cool, I'll take it. Righto, done. Righto, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, as always, hit that like button for me. Um, please leave a comment if you like the house, anything you would change differently. Um, let me know if there's anybody in your family that um, has or is suffering from cancer, you know, and you need someone to talk to, I'm more than happy to talk to you guys if you if you need just someone to vent to. Please, as I said, donate to your local charity that helps people with cancer and their families as well, whether it be the Cancer Council, as I said, in Australia or somewhere else. And um, I really hope Jade does actually see this. I really hope she does like it. And um, I guess I do have to say that um, I love you lots, cuz. And um, yeah, you're a very, very strong woman, and I'm very, very proud of you, and um, I wish there was more I could do, but unfortunately there's not. But yeah, as I said, I do love you more than you'll ever realise, and um, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, please do so. It's been Brito. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.